Hey everyone, Tracy at Mystically Divine Tarot. How's everyone today? I hope you're all doing great. Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's daily tarot reading for Sunday, February 12th. Let's see what's going on in the general collective today. Follow the signs, card number 44. So could be seeing signs and synchronicities about something today. For sure, follow those signs. So take those little signs as nudges from the universe here. Let's get some tarot out. What's going on for everybody today? Wow, four of wands. Feeling very committed. Feeling at peace. Feeling committed to something and very peaceful about it is what I'm feeling here. Committed to something and peaceful about it. Could be your job, could be, you know, happy in your work, could be in a relationship. This could also be about marriage as well. Another four. Wow, that's four, 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 four. So four, 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 four. <laughs> Lots of fours. You might be seeing a lot of fours. Stability in finances is what's sticking out to me here. Feeling very grateful. Hmm, so something... Uh, feeling like you're stable in your finances here. This could be about work for sure. It could be, it certainly could be about feeling um, stable in finances with a partner as well. Could be married here, okay? Could be uh, getting married. Feeling stable here in that connection um, financially. Let's see what else. Page of Wands. You're super excited about something here for sure. There's some sort of exciting news coming your way here. Some sort of exciting news coming your way that will make you feel stable here maybe. Could be getting news of a raise or something like that. Look at this. Six of Pentacles judgment together. Yeah, someone giving back. You're finally getting your justice here. Some sort of a judgment here. It could be about the law as well. Some sort of a judgment in the law here could be in your favor or something like that. But there's some sort of a decision made, truth revealed, decision made. Something about reciprocation as well. So you're feeling, uh, this is also about generosity. So you're feeling someone being generous with you possibly here as well. I'm going to get some clarifiers out here. What's going on for everybody today? Four of Wands. Why the Four of Wands? Mm, this is nice energy, though. Definitely feeling pretty stable in Seven of Swords. Yeah, so you... Okay, so you're feeling at peace. You might have been deceiving yourself about something. You might have been had some anxiety about something in the past, is what I'm feeling. And something here... <clears throat> excuse me. Something here exciting news really opened your eyes and, and let you see that you were kind of like deceiving yourself is what I'm feeling here today. So you were in anxiety and now you've reached this level of peace about it, whatever that may be. Okay. Um, for some reason, uh, definitely feeling four of wands is about feeling stable um, and peaceful about something here. We have stability a lot out here in this, this reading right now. We have uh, stability on the Four of Wands, Four of Pentacles as well. Is about stability and finances, something to do with your... Look at this, end of the pain. Yeah, something, something was really uh, causing you a lot of anxiety is what I'm feeling here. Okay, something that was really causing you a lot of anxiety. Uh, it's coming to an end now. Something about this exciting news is what I'm feeling, or this judgment here too could be that could be the exciting news. Okay, uh, you you're receiving news of a judgment of some sort in your favor. This could be uh, something to do with the law reciprocation. Um, so it could be about money. It could be about a divorce settlement. It could be, yeah, it could be pretty much anything here. Page of Wands. What is this exciting news about here? Page of Wands. I'm almost feeling like because those came out after it that that is the exciting news here. 
okay and i read intuitively so uh if spirits pointing me in that direction i feel like those three there are kind of intertwined okay this exciting news is about this judgment let's see page of pentacle yeah it is and it's something about finances here yeah it's something about a money situation in your life here that you are waiting for some sort of a decision uh, again could be multitude of things uh could be a divorce settlement could be someone owed you money okay and they they've come into some money and they're able to reciprocate give it back okay something like that even okay it might not even have to do with the law uh, for some of you it may for some of you it may not these are the general energies always always take what resonates and leave the rest behind right two of pentacles all of these general readings on youtube even pick a card readings those are general readings you're drawn to one that's great some of those messages are definitely for you some of them may not be okay or none of them may be you know um two of pentacles yeah there's definitely there's some sort of balance coming into your life right now it's making you feel very stable it's making you feel good okay financially feeling good okay something you might be gaining signs and synchronicities pointing you to realize this okay um that could be why following the signs here yeah there's some sort of something to do with your finances here that was what i'm feeling okay we're going to ask about love life now this could certainly be about your love life as well yeah definitely could be hearing something um from someone that maybe was non-reciprocal in the past uh making you feel very stable in the connection maybe uh they were it could be them possibly waiting on some sort of a judgment you know um you could have been deceiving yourself telling yourself this was never going to happen or something like that definitely could be about your love life but i'm definitely feeling it's about financial stability here <clears throat> so something to do with that excuse me wow resilience yeah you've been pretty strong in your love life here as well um you've been very resilient in life in general i feel here uh but this is about your love life so you've been um really strong and in, in your love life so meaning if if things weren't going well you were still kind of standing in your own power kind of doing your own thing um being very resilient through it and you know knowing that you deserve you know more or whatever something like that uh knowing that you deserve to be happy things like that so we have this card here close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful you can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in. There's that resilience, right? So if you are finding yourself kind of in, you know, not so great situations in your love life, I feel like you've come to that realization here that you deserve joy, okay? Um, and you've been resilient through the tough times. What else for our love lives? Assess the situation so yeah go in with eyes wide open is what i'm hearing here go in with eyes wide open see people for who they are in your love life here um so if someone is exhibiting um some sort of red flag or something like that just really assess that situation um don't go in with your eyes closed know that you deserve to feel loved and be strong through it you know not everyone is made for you not everyone will be a perfect fit what else in love please release yeah so yeah release any expectations of people okay um don't expect someone to be you know the the, the exact um match for you is what i'm feeling here release those expectations and just kind of allow people to show you who they really are is what i'm feeling here um and if they're not what you expect, then, you know, just release them and move forward, right? What else? Wow. Someone might come into your life, though, that makes you feel in perfect harmony here. 
So yeah, assess the situation, right? Really pay attention. If someone is really um, feeling like, you know, they are someone that could work in your, you know, work with your energy, then absolutely assess that situation and move forward the way you feel is right for you, right? Um, if you're feeling in, in perfect harmony with this person, then absolutely, you know, do what you feel is best. If you want to move it forward, um, then move it forward, you know. But also, for some of you, if you're meeting up with people that aren't feeling in perfect harmony, um, also know that it's okay to release that, okay? Communication. So a lot of communication in your love life here could be communicating feelings with someone else here. Someone could be communicating with you uh, how they're feeling about this love situation. What else in our love lives today for the general collective? Peace. Wow. Yeah. So for some of you, you might feel at peace when you meet someone here. You might They might bring you some sort of inner peace, okay, which could bring about this feeling of harmony. Uh, this is also card number 11 here. I just noticed as I covered it up with this card. Uh, card number 11 as well. So two ones there. That could be your correct path. This person that brings you peace, right? That is very important to feel that in a connection, in a relationship, or, uh, or even if you're just dating. What else? For the general collective in love today, please. What else? Very soon. So very soon you're going to overcome any obstacle. I can't put the deck back. Any obstacles of your past, okay? Uh, if you've come across a few, you know, frogs, <laughs> you know, people that weren't for you, okay? Um, people that weren't for you. Very soon you're going to reach this level of peace in your love life is what I feel this is saying, okay? Um, very soon it, it, you're going to feel that joy that you know you deserve, Okay. All right, guys. Well, that is what I have for you for today. Again, I feel like this is a mixed bag. Could be a little bit about your finances. And then this is about your love life here. But I hope this reading was helpful either way. Um, please remember to give it a like and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Have a wonderful day and I will see you tomorrow.